I need to talk to you about this. So these two are standalone SPFs that are for the face for a different skin type. So we have one that's mattifying and we have one that has hyaluronic and is anti-age. Along with that, they launched a mineral for the face and this one is a factor 35, 100% zinc, 24% and it's tinted. Both of these are factor 50. They both have comparable ingredients, five types of antioxidants and they make the same sorts of claims. They're unscented and they have the exact same UV filters. It's just a matter of do you want something that's going to be for hydration or do you want something that's going to control shine? Positives would be that they are fragrance free. The volumes of both of these products is really impressive. You're getting 75 mils and they come up to about $25 Canadian. So not stupid money. It's good value in that respect. 